Hello, folks and fuckheads, it's me, VROXS of 2 and welcome to a completely unscripted random updates and crap video of whatever random fro that random footage I throw on screen. I'm sorry I've not been updating lately, I've been ridiculously busy with a variety of shenanigans. Like, I'm um, working on cosplay for the upcoming cons, working on some other videos, working on some schoolwork, playing Team Fortress 2 and Animal Crossing. Well, and at the moment, Animal Crossing, working on cosplay, and um, Homestuck have been still in my life. Yes, the Homestuck germs have infected me. RUN WHILE YOU STILL CAN BEFORE THEY CORRUPT YOU AS WELL! But that's besides the point. How have you guys been lately? Let me know in the comments. Um, let me talk about some things I've been intending to talk about recently. First off, YouTube and them being a bunch of idiots. They forced another- er, they forced another channel layout on us again. Which, um, in my opinion, the- last time they- they forced a channel- a new channel layout on us, it was a step down. THIS IS SUCH A STEP DOWN TO THE POINT WHERE YOU TUMBLE DOWN THE STAIRS AND FACEPLANT ON THE GROUND LEVEL step down for this new one. They get rid of, like, all the customizability whatsoever, it's more awkward to use, and it looks atrocious, and all around, I do not like it. If you like it, that's fine, it's just, I don't. I just have a feeling next layout, they'll get rid of all your videos, replace them with, and replace them with ads for better YouTubers, get rid of your avatar and your little banner, and just get rid of everything. I know, I assure you, they're gonna do that. But that's besides the point. And then there was E3. Um, I'm not sure how to talk about E3 without exploding into excitement. For the most part, okay. Well, we're into the Nintendo stuff, because, um, Sony's press conference was interesting, and it was kind of cool seeing, not, uh, Sony, well, kind of make fun of the Xbox One. And I'm excited for Final Fantasy XV, for whatever reason. It looks really cool, and I can't wait to play it. Even though it was really Final Fantasy XIII Versus, which has been development for God knows how long now. Um, the new Kingdom Hearts, well, I'm a Kingdom Hearts fan. You can tell from my name, Roxas. So that one I'm super duper excited about. Microsoft's press conference, it bored me to sleep. There was one thing, one thing that seemed interesting there, which was Project Spark, and that was it. Nothing else. So yeah, bleh. Same thing goes for Ubisoft's and my, and, um... And, um, okay, that nah, same thing for U Ubisoft's and EA's short the whole Project Spark thing. Because it's, like, mostly bland shooter stuff. Not a huge fan. And then there was Nintendo stuff. Which was super duper exciting, super duper interesting, super duper awesome, and my head recently exploded seven times while watching it. I'm so excited for the new Smash Brothers! I love how the, uh, how the... Where to start? I love the fact that they're tweaking it so much so it has better, better gameplay. The fact that the, the Bowser is now acting di differently and acting like a well, better character. I like the fact that they're introducing new characters like the Villager, which looks like a ton of fun to play. Mega Man, of course, because Mega Man is an awesome character, enough said. And you guys might have a hissy fit at this, but I actually think we we fit Trainer so far, my favorite um, new character so far, just from how she plays. She looks like a ton of fun to play as, and I can't wait to play the new Smash Brothers, and I... And I can't can't wait to hear more. More. I've been been looking on the new Smash Bros. site every day religiously lately. When will they update? I have no idea. So yeah. Um. What else? The new Super Mario Brothers game looked cute for the most part, but I think Nintendo's having a problem. Besides for new power ups, they've not really been doing much with the Mario series with what's new. I miss stuff like Super Mario Sunshine, where I was like. Completely interesting and different and stuff than everything else. Sorry, I just I love Black Sheep's in general for game series. I actually am a fan of Zelda 2. Axter slips out a flame shield. So yeah, and um, the 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 new and the new Donkey Kong also looks interesting. But I need to play Donkey Kong Country's Return Turn again. But that's besides the point. Of course, new Pokemon was interesting with introducing the Fairy type, which. This could either be really cool or horribly unbalanced things. In Pokemon Amai or Emil, however you pronounce it, Emil? No, that doesn't sound like Emil. I was waiting for them to basically put that in the game. Or something like that in the game. I can't wait to play with my Pokemon. It's gonna be so much fun. And strangely, the uh, that um, art game they showed off at the press conference also really interested me. Well, 
I like to doodle. You know, it's obvious if you're on my tum if you look at my Tumblr. But yeah. So that's how I felt about eat this eat the sea free. Pretty much it. I say besides for Nintendo's pref for Nintendo and Sony, it was a bad E free. If you include them, it was a good E free. But I always feel like it's a bad E free link to Microsoft, up Ubisoft, and EA, because all of those usually bore me to sleep. Originally, I kind of use like some most of the previous Microsoft conferences as as what to put on when I'm having trouble sleeping. Both my lettuce tea and stuff. So yeah. Um, what else I need to tell you about? Oh yeah, the videos that are coming up. Um, first, I have to announce the top ten the top fifteen characters I eventually the cosplay as. This will be on on hold until next year due to I've started work on most of the characters. Heck, I've actually finished a couple for the upcoming cons, which we'll talk about later. But that's the point. So, like, I'll do that next year for whatever characters I want to do for that. But for new countdowns, um, I'm doing one for Stelios's birth, a late present for Stelios's birthday. I can't say what it is. It's just been have, having trouble doing that because I'm like, because I need to ask that are YouTubers if they mind me referencing them in the video and um, re-downloading some Stelios's stuff stuff because it glitched and all of that jazz. Um, there's another one on which is gonna be a uh, top seven characters I'm iron gaming. That one's been going. Pretty well for the most part. The script is basically done. That one will be out probably sometime this month. And due to a request, I'm doing top 15 favorite franchises, which will be sometime in August or September. So yeah, for countdowns, that's what I'm doing. But I'm going to talk about countdown, uh, just countdowns for now, because my other projects will be higgledy piggledy. So yeah. Um. Also in news is what cons I'm going to. Tomorrow, or tomorrow as of I'm, as I'm uh, recording this, it's going to be Anime Overload, which is a convention in the Austin area, which I so can't wait for. I've been literally bouncing off the walls. I was excited can't, for this, the con that's coming up. It's going to be so fun. And it's going to be the same place that Brony Fanfare was, and I liked the hotel they used for Brony Fanfare, so yeah. Um, my lineup as of right now is... Friday, I'm going to be a white mage from Final Fantasy. Uh, Saturday, I'm going to be um, po Pokemon Breeder Trainer class out of um, uh, uh, Pokemon Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. And on Sunday, as of right now, I'm doing Pluto from Black Butler with the Hamlet outfit. I'm going to do a group po cosplay for Anime Overload and for San Japan of Black Butler. They chose me to be... Or actually, I chose, chose to be Pluto. Okay, but... If any of you are going to be showing up at Anime Overload, I can't wait to see you and talk to you and hang out with you and stuff. And I will try to get put at least post pictures on Tumblr of my Anime Overload adventures. If not, on here as well. Then there's Classic Game Fest, which is like 13th and 14th, I think. Which, for that one, I'm going to do my Bub Cosplay and White Mage, probably. Which you've already seen both in videos previously. And then there's the big one, San Japan. The big massive freaking convention that most airports will cry, cry from how small they are, uh, are in comparison, and that includes the, to including the places where they store the airplanes. That convention is massive, and it was actually my first convention I ever went to. But for that one, I know one day's going to be Pluto, one the other days I plan to do Smeargle from Pokemon or a humanoid version of the, of it, because I want to do um the live-action Pokemon battle with it, but I need to see what's the rules for that. And then there's, um, a, I want to do a changeling from M from MLP, which hopefully I'll get pictures and stuff up on here. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing for most of the comments. Hope I can see you some, of some of you guys there and it'll be fun and stuff. And let me know in the comments if you want me to upload oh, like a slideshow for my pictures on here. I don't mind doing that. Th and that's really all I've been wanting to update about. Sorry for the lack of videos. There will be more soon. Hope you guys had a been having a good summer. Er, see you guys next time. Wow, this went on way too long. Oh well.